What up, y'all? Big Waldowski up in here. Oh, I know why I'm rushing today. It was just, I mean, I'm already halfway through it. A little monster vodka. Well, I figured out, you know, any of y'all familiar with some apple pie moonshine? Ooh, ha <laughs> Had, uh, I mean, it tastes good. That could be trouble. You must run and call the cops. But, uh, <coughs> yeah, here we are, man. <clears throat> man, my voice is trying to come back. It's doing what it's doing. Oh, I got a few, so we're going to, I'm just going to hop right to it. Uh, right off the bat, I know I got this. I mean, we all know the blue bag. This is going to be shreddy. <clears throat> so, the first shreddy, I think what they dropped that in like 19, I think. It was a pre-pleat, I'm pretty sure. Uh, matter of fact, if I remember correctly, the first shreddy dropped 917 of 19, which means that it dropped on my birthday. So come September and y'all want to give me something for my birthday, just know that I'm, you know, Virgo, the innocent virgin. Your boy Roach, the big Waldowski, 917. Uh, yeah, so then the following one, man, they dropped the uh, shreddy 2.0. Or what they called the Shreddy 2.0 in uh, 20. Then in January of 21, they dropped a redo of the original Shreddy that people were calling the Shreddy 3.0, which I'm still not 100% sure why, because it was exactly the same as the Shreddy 1. So they had the Shreddy 1, then the Shreddy 2.0. And then I'm not sure uh, this one I'm wearing, man. They just, uh, they just call it the Shreddy. And, and I would say... Okay, cool, because I've heard people calling it the third gen. I've heard people calling it the fourth gen. I've heard people calling it all kinds of different things. I'm not 100% sure, but uh, with that being said, let's uh, let's tap off into this. Let me get in here. Once again, the handy-dandy Microtech getting started. And uh, what do we got? Oh, yeah, that's exactly what... You know, the Shreddy always comes with the... What are they calling it? Well, see, they're calling it the Shreddy Gen 4 on the uh, on the uh, invoice here. The Shreddy Gen 4 women's, Shreddy Gen 4 men's. And they always come with the cool little uh, sticker pack, you know. Shred till I'm dead. <clears throat> and something funny I did see on the groups about this one. That uh, it's going to be spelled. Well, now see, look. Shreddy 3.0 right on the tag. So this is the 3.0. I guess I'm confused. Oh, um, that was my tips. <clears throat> so this one here, All right, this one here is mine. <laughs> Shit. And then, uh, you know, one day I will figure out how to get rid of all the crinkle crinkle. Um, I am going tonight. I need I need another pack of uh, I need another pack of wooden hangers, man, to just do away with <clears throat> all of them. Yeah, it's crazy to me that uh, this is the 3.0, even on the men's bag. These fucking plastic things, man. One day, I'm going to find a use for them, I'm telling you. Somebody come up with something. Make a chandelier out of them. Or this. Not this shit. I mean, I don't know. I like saving the bags, but I don't really know if there's a purpose for saving those yet. <coughs> man, this voice, this throat. <clears throat> oh, and they spelled it right on the tag. Uh, that light is reflecto. Well, it's better than being dark over here. Shred till you're dead. Dixon and Shreddy. Put that up there. Oh, yeah, this is what I was talking about, man. I don't know if uh, any of y'all are going to be able to see it. Uh, let me pop this up. First of all, let me hold the shirt up. Because <clears throat> this gray and pink is really dope. I mean, I think everything's dope, man. I always... And, uh, and I didn't realize that there is like a... There is like a purplish and a mauve almost in there in them fine lines. There's almost like a purple and I don't know... If you, I don't know if we can get in there and see that or not. I don't know. This, I mean, I'm shooting in HD, I think. Pretty sure. I mean, it says it is, but I don't know. Oh, these things, too. Uh, I'm about to quit collecting those. But, uh, yeah, so it's got, I mean, it's pink and gray predominantly, but it does have, like, the purple and uh, maybe maybe that's mauve or something. I don't know what, what color you call that. <coughs> maroon. And it's not maroon. I don't, I don't know. Purple. Purple, pink, and gray. There's the uh, tag. And you know how I do it, man. I'm going to have the, uh, I'll get these up in here for you. But I'm going to get it, you know, here, here. 
I had my guy give me props for that on a, uh, on one of the things, on one of the comments. Right here's where they misspelled it. And I actually uh, will probably try to show a little extra attention to that, that misspelled button. <clears throat> what they got for the, uh, the lower, the, well, the upper tag. Somebody was also telling me how I wouldn't like the green shreddy tag. Well, that's not green. It's, it's like their teal. That's their color. I mean, it matches. It's a shreddy tag. <clears throat> oh, this one doesn't really match very well. I mean, it does just because it doesn't clash, just because it's shreddy. But I bet this is what he was talking about because this is not my flavor to really throw something. I would have put a gray one on there or a pink one on there or even a white one with gray or pink lettering. Or this, yeah, this is <clears throat> this is probably, uh, this is a fail to me on a style fail. I would have put, this would have been pink or gray with this being the opposite. But, it, I mean, whatever, man. They put black in there. It's inside. They got that as gray. The buttons are black. <clears throat> so all in all, the project and the product works. And I dig all their purple and pink stuff. I'm into the colorful shit, man. I like I like it. I, I mean, you see me out here. Usually I button my top button, but I thought maybe thought maybe buttoning the top button might be something to do with um, messing with my voice. My chick saw somebody. She never met nobody before me to tuck their ears in their hat, man. And she seen a post. Uh, it was some somebody showing off their Dixon shirt, and she seen a uh, hashtag tuck your ears. I don't know if they was talking, I mean, <clears throat> I don't think they was talking shit about me. If they was, they can come get it. I think it's in Michigan. Uh, but yeah, this uh, this Shreddy 3.0, I guess, or Generation 4. This is a real nice pattern. The material feels good. The cut is good. Um, I don't know if you can see the pattern uh, down the button. Stay. I mean, it all lines up. It's, it's real uniform. The pockets are at the same level, both sides. I mean, everything about mine. This one that I opened, the other one. So everything about this one that I opened is good. That means I, uh, as long as I don't rip it or wreck it or stain it or do anything bad to it, <clears throat> that one will likely wind up for sale. <clears throat> and then, man, I don't know if I should open this bag or this box. Uh, I mean, this is just a single one. I already know what this is. This is gonna be that. Uh, this is gonna be that Clockworks uh, uh, rye, I think. <laughs> yep, from Clockworks. <clears throat> I don't even need a knife on this. This one's open. <clears throat> Excuse me, man. <clears throat> I apologize for all this coughing and shit that I've been doing the last week or so. But <clears throat> something's got to give. Put out. Clockworks almost always gives me some cool stickers. Wait, maybe not this time. No. Dang, I spoke too soon. Every time I've ever ordered from Clockworks, they've given me a whole bunch of stickers and shit, man. And this time they didn't. <clears throat> but on the same note, they did hook me up. Cause I'll tell you what. They sold out of this flannel so fast. Uh, they sold out of it all extra fast, so I hit them up. Because I buy, I, I mean, I buy flannels. So I hit them up, man, was like, look, dude, I buy everything in the Midwest. The snow was all messed up. Everything was crazy. And dude was like, look, man, he was like, give me your uh, payment information. And I was like, just use my account. And uh, he was like, if we get an XL back in stock, I will. Uh, you'll receive an invoice. And I was like, man, that don't sound very promising. He was like, oh, yeah, I'm not making you any promises. And uh, the next day I received an invoice, and here we go, man. I got the ride in the collection. I wish I could keep it sealed, but you know how I roll, man. We're opening it. We're gonna open it. <clears throat> Matter of fact, I might even, I should pull down. Well, no, it might be a different video, a different time. Uh, I'd like to compare it to the Juno, the 1903, because I hear everybody out here talking about how it looks just like the 1903. It looks just, the Juno is just another 1903, and the Juno is far from a 1903, man. Where's I have a Juno right here somewhere. Where's it? Uh, let me see. This should be all right. So what's that? No, that's a halo. What's this? Is this a Juno? I think this is Juno right here. Let me see the buttons. Yeah, the Juno is right here. So we're gonna we're gonna pull this sleeve out. I'm not gonna pull the flannel down. I'm not gonna go that far. And I also have what's this? This is an OG 1903. So right off the bat, you can see that yeah, they're similar. These are not the same flannel, man. This 1903 and this Juno are far from being the same flannel. And I'm sure that we're going to come up with the, uh, there's a, <clears throat> I'm surprised this ain't got no, none about Jack Daniels on it. But there's the Clockworks Dixon tag off the, off this rye. Oh, here's a, here's the Jack Daniels piece. Okay. Huh. I ripped it. Son of a bitch. <clears throat> oh, well. Uh, Plastic, <coughs> plastic and tissue for days. That's everywhere. It's everywhere. 
Okay. I mean, yeah, it's just, it's, it's clearly a lot darker, man. It's a lot darker scheme. It's almost like a murked out. Uh, it's like, it, to me, this is more, I mean, people are calling it the 1903 and calling it the Juno and blah, blah, blah. To me, this is more like a murked out with, with a, uh, like a, almost a burnt orange line in it. Um, yeah, it's, it's, uh, it's definitely not, I don't know, man. Give me a minute and, uh, there's the tag, Jack Daniels, Dixon and Clockworks. I mean... I understand this collaboration, but I never understood why why they don't why they don't do a, a specific just Jack Daniels and just Clockworks. Why it becomes a tree a tree way, you know what I'm saying? They in the tree fort. <laughs> uh, <clears throat> and then you got the uh, the pocket the pocket tag Jack Daniels. What we got at the bottom? What, how's that one looking? Okay, and it matches. <clears throat> Black with the burnt orange, looking good. What do we got here for this? Again, black with the burnt orange for the glasses white. So let me hold this up one time <clears throat> as a whole. I think we're oh, getting in there. Are we in there? You can see it. Uh, hold it right here. See that pattern? And now let's do this one more time. Let's uh, bring up this sleeve. Let's try to see what we can do here, man. We're gonna. This is the this sleeve. Uh, this, uh, here go the Juno sleeve. Clearly a different shirt. And then one more time. I'm going to try to hold down. Man, dang. We're, we're trying too hard here. So, if we... Son of a beaver. Okay, we got this. We got this. And we got this. These are all clearly different shirts. I mean, they look... Yeah, they're all a buffalo pattern style with a with an outline of uh, orangish flavor. But uh, we got a burnt orange. We got a hot orange. And then we got this one. Matter of fact, the Juno shouldn't even be in the same equation. Because I'll tell you what. It's got multi. It's got one, two, three, and one, two, three, four lines. I don't know what this pattern's called. But it's got many more lines. So that is not the same. These. Uh, I can't hold on to them. Man. Once again, clearly different. I mean, there's, it's very apparent that these are a different color scheme. Same pattern. Matter of fact, like I said. Oh, where are going? Uh, I could be wrong here. But to me, it's more reminiscent of this. Uh, it looks like a murked out with a burnt orange line. I don't know. It's a little light for a murked out even. So I guess it is. Whatever, man. I don't know. It's this whole thing. People just be wanting to hate for no reason. Oh, I thought something was on me. But, uh, everybody wants to be mad at something, man. Everybody's so quick to complain. Karens and Craigs or whatever they call them. But yeah, there's that, man. This is a, yeah, this is a cool, cool flannel, man. I, you know, I like them all. Um, I'm always into it. I'm real, real happy Clockworks made this happen for me. <clears throat> I'm pretty, uh, pretty geeked about it. So that's a cool thing, man. So we got, we got the uh, new shreddy, the pink and gray shreddy. We got the new Clockworks uh, rye. And then here, I'm not 100 sure what's even in this box. My chick ordered it for me. Um, I know that she did order the S and S. She's ordered the. Uh, what else did she order? She ordered the Bowie. Uh, she ordered one of the performance machines because my thing glitched out and I didn't get it. I wound up either way. One box came from her, one box came from me. But this, I mean, there's no way that the Bowie got to Michigan already. Um, I don't think the SNS uh, teardrop should have got here yet. But I can't think of anything else. And I just ordered Gore today. <coughs> Matter of fact, let's see what we got in here. Huh? Okay, boys and girls, we do have the teardrop. Yeah, okay, for that, um, before we even get into it, another little sippy dippy. <clears throat> this moonshine will put some hair on your chesticles. <clears throat> Maybe it'll clear my throat. <clears> throat> you know what I mean? <laughs> One thing you'll learn if you keep watching these is I clearly drink too much. It's uh, very apparent that I do drink too much. Okay, yeah. Oh, shit, I forgot about this. Man, I mean, I didn't forget about it. I just kind of forgot about it. You know what I mean? So, look, it's that Evo shirt. Map. Oh, you know what I mean? <clears throat> What's it say? Survival of the fittest. Man, and if you know what's good, that's the truth, boy. I'll tell you, an Evo will run. If you can turn a ranch, your Evo going to stay running. Brat, 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 but that bat. Um, let me see. I think in this pile over here somewhere. Yeah, see, <clears throat> which one is this? 
Uh, this is the, uh, oh yeah, every day I'm shoveling. I got this back a couple, <clears throat> I don't remember how many orders ago. So I got the Evo, the shovel, and then I got the Moose one, which is the knuckle. <clears throat> mm. Man, these coughs, I, shoot. I mean, I do, like I said, man, I apologize for all this coughing because I know it sucks to listen to. As bad as a bad crinkle. But now we're going to tap off, man. I would, I'm super glad my chick. And she told me, man, I told y'all the other day that I only got one of these and she bought me two. Uh, she's spoiling me sometimes. <clears throat> but I buy her all hers, too. I mean, so that's what's good. Yeah, here's the, uh, she did get herself one. This is probably one of the sexiest windows I've seen. I'm going to toss that over there in her pile. <clears throat> as long as this one is floaty. Floaty dotty. Uh, yeah, just see this one. <coughs> this one's looking real good. <coughs> Sticker ain't messed up nothing, so that was staying off to the side. And this one, this one's gonna be mine. Ooh, she got me a treat, a little present. Okay, man, <coughs> y'all ain't seen me open all of them, or I don't think you have anyway. But uh, that's everything in the bag. Let me throw this one. In. So I got my daughter's. Uh, I got the Tiffany blue and the white tumblers. You know the uh, studded tumblers. Got them for them for Christmas. I got my chick the black one, and then she got us the yellow one, and I got the, or she got me the uh, green one, <clears throat> and you know, obviously, I have an affinity for pink, because I like to test people, see if they want to try to test my manhood or something, so, uh, shoot, she wound up, she got me the pink one, <clears throat> so, <clears throat> you're probably going to catch me out here drinking Big Wodowski's in these, somebody going to say something, and we're going to get it in, <clears throat> it's going to be fun times. But yeah, these are sweet to me. I don't know if you've uh, had them or not. They're a lot higher. I mean, they are just some generic shit, but with the uh, with the Dixon logo actually emblazoned on the front, it uh, it's a it's actually a pretty. I mean, it feels sturdy. It feels nicely insulated. Um, I have noticed that uh, that some of the on like our black one and stuff, some of the uh, the the matte finish has been coming off. But my chick uses it every day in and out of the drink holder, in and out of the drink holder in her truck. I mean, it gets a lot of use. And just barely seeing a little bit of it coming off on the base here. So so they're showing to be pretty tough for a $20 tumble. I mean, it ain't, this ain't no Yeti, man. But it is a Dixon. <clears throat> and it's kind of nifty. I dig it. Uh, I'll be drinking out of a pink tumbler, man. Let somebody get it. <clears throat> here comes what I've been waiting to do. Tap off into this. Here you are. I'm going to silica pack. <laughs> <coughs> They have super good. I got two. Matter of fact, I'll always be telling y'all I'm gonna sell the other one. I ain't selling the other one of this, man. I'm about to keep it till I wear this out because this is so cold to me. This is my favorite release of the year so far, probably. Um, I wish they didn't release so much red and black. I did get the guar this coming, but man, I, I can't be the only one that's sick of all these red and black releases. They gotta chill out with red and black. <clears throat> but I bought guar because I'm a scum dog, baby. Uh black. <laughs> SMS, and you know anything about the teardrop, man? The teardrop is, I mean, it's that. I mean, if you know anything about Harley's, if you know anything about anything that I've been talking about, you know about SNS Motors, man. You know I buy SNS Performance. I mean, it's just what it is. It's proven. It's proven performance, man. That's why they they use that as their uh, statement. SNS proven performance. <laughs> yep. But this piece, man. This is a nice ass shirt. I mean, <clears throat> the color, it's just black, gray, and little tiny white line in there. <laughs> white lines. No oh, mine. <laughs> yeah, this is, oh, God, dang it, man, this is nice. <sighs> That's a nice performance. We get that in there. I always be doing that, eh, looking up, trying to see the, uh, I'm going to try to start looking down and put the thug out on y'all. <clears throat> but that was the button. Man, these pearlescent snaps. Hold on, let me catch that pearl in there, boy. Ooh, ooh, snap, snap, ball, bling, bling. Every time I come around, I don't know. <clears throat> the S and S logo. And then the, it, I mean, and it stayed black and black and white, man. It kept it cool uh, for me. You know, I like it uh, when they match. Yeah, and then here the teardrop. Huh. Boy, this uh, this is a. Uh, this is, I mean, like I said, man, I, I always be, <laughs> I always be jogging all their stuff, man. But, uh, this one is, this one is my favorite currently of the year. Uh, 
and they get in there with the black and black and white or black and so it's uh, black and gray. I can't really tell the lighting in here's a little strange for me. And then see, and they put that gray uh, that's cold in here. It belonged just like this gray with the black on the glasses thing. Uh, but to me, I mean, like I said, they should have put a gray one in that uh, in that pink shreddy. <clears throat> but this is sweet, dude. This uh, yeah, man, I am I am into it. I'm probably gonna wear this out tonight. I was gonna wear that pink shreddy tonight, but now I'm probably gonna wear this or a little string right here. Though I'm on. This is app. Got it. I need to uh, <clears throat> sound off in the comments, man. Let me know which. Uh, I need a shaver. I got a couple things that need a good shave. Oh, oh that OG boneless is clean, but there's some right here somewhere. This uh, I don't know, man. This gravel pit could use a shave. Not really. It's kind of clean, but it, it could use one. Um, where is man? There's something right here somewhere that needs one. So I don't see it. Huh. Either way, I know I got a, damn, I don't see the damn thing. Somewhere up there, there's a grayscale that needs a, needs a shave pretty damn bad. Uh, <clears throat> might even just get another one because of it. Or no, it isn't a grayscale. My bad, it's a dark horse. It's a dark horse that needs a shave. I need a grayscale. I don't even have a grayscale right now. I need a grayscale. I need a Lafayette. I need a Gunner. I need an Alameda. I need an Aloe Vera. So there's a bunch I need, man. Uh. My, my boulevards haven't showed up yet. What did I just get? I just got something, man. I just got a... Oh, I got the V-Twin Visionary on its way. I don't know what kind of condition it's in. I just saw it up, and it was at the right price, so I grabbed it. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know, dude. This, uh, it's going to be a minute. I'm going to be talking about this one for a minute out here, boys. <coughs> this thing is sweet to me. Yep. So, yeah, I guess what did we run through, man? We just ran through... I mean, we did that in under 25 minutes, man. I, uh... What do we got? We got we got the uh the SNS, we got the Evo shirt, we got the new shreddy, and we had the uh what what oh it's on my lap, man. The new clockwork dry. So yeah, that's uh shoot, it was a decent mail day, man. Uh after a few bad ones. What did we order open yesterday? Oh, we opened the flannel bunkers yesterday. <clears throat> and I was bitching about none of these coming. And as it sits right now, uh <clears throat> uh the gore is on its way. I got the uh the Bowie is on its way, and my Anvil should be on its way, and then I still got the Sherpa uh, on its way, or the, uh, you know, the blankets should be on their way sometime, somewhere, some way. Hold on, we gotta put a little more. Ooh, and you can always tell the difference, man, when people make this with a... Well, 151, or if they make it with a little trip to the mountains, if you know what I mean. Because I'm from, you know, we up here in the, we in Michigan, so you know you can say we're 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 right here. You know, we're the only state we can do that. Uh, but when somebody makes a trip to the mountains and uh, throws together some right moonshine, some apple pie, <clears throat> it'll make your eyebrows grow. But uh, oh man, there was one other thing. What was I going to touch base on? Oh shoot, uh, a few things I got on their way. I don't even remember, man. So I guess, uh, shoot, it is what it is, dude. That's, uh, that's where we're at. Damn, let me think. The Anvil, the Guar, the Bowie, the Sherpa. Oh, that shotgun, man, dropping tomorrow. And the, uh, oh, shoot, what's the uh, line flannel called? I can't even remember what it was called. But there's a line flannel dropping tomorrow and the shotgun dropping tomorrow. So this week, man, you're going to get to see a few cool things. And with all that said, man, I, uh, oh yeah, my video yesterday, that's what I was going to touch base on this too. Let me, uh, speak on it. <clears throat> in yesterday's video, I commented about how Danny has already released more this year than he did in the first four years he was in business. And I was wrong, man, because it's just been January and a little bit of February. So I got to looking and in 13, 14, 15, and 16, he dropped 57 flannels. And I counted back just to see there have been 59 flannels. And I could be wrong, give, give or take a couple, you know what I mean? Because I just 36912 uh, through the Dixon Flannel Guide on Instagram. Because they're generally pretty reliable of what, you know, it's not in chronological order, but it is kind of for the newer stuff and you can kind of go back. But just since October, there have been 59. And in the first four years, there was 57. So if you look at it like that, man. Uh, uh, November, December, January, we're now in February, so in four months, more flannels have dropped 
than he dropped in the first four years in business. So uh, right there, that's something to put your pipe, put in your pipe and smoke, you know. I mean, there's a reason that it's tough for people to keep up. Now, I hear a lot of people bitching, man. They're like, oh, no more red ones. Oh, no more this ones or no more that ones. But you got to think, man, I got black. I got gray and orange right here. I got gray and black right here. I got purple and teal on. This one's pink and gray. Um, I mean, the ones coming, the, there's the red and black guar coming. But then there's the other. The Bowie is pink and blue and black. Um, that shotgun tomorrow is green and black with a red stripe. I mean, like... Man, there's been some variants. Y'all are just tripping because there's been so many. Yeah, there's been a lot of red ones. Yeah, we've had the we had the Ninth Street, we had the SoCal Speed Company, we had the I mean we've got shoot the Viper. Shoot, there's most, almost all of them right here, man. We're the seller. What else we had right like, recently, man? We I mean the Slayer, now the Guar. What's that? Oh, the Clockworks. Uh I mean, yeah, there's been some red and black, red and black, red and white, whatever. But there's been a lot of gray, man. There ain't been what they need to drop, they need to give us some more yellow, some more purple. I mean, I'm all about, mm -hmm. I like the colorful ones, but my mainstay is always going to be black and white, man. Black and white for life. I'm telling you, I live a black and white life. Uh, so, yeah, if uh, if you're hearing me out there, Danny, more black and white. Let me get a, plus I need a pair of white chinos, man. I need, I need them chinos in white. Hmm. <sighs> All right, Ugh. I gotta chill out. Y'all gonna have me extra drunk by 5 p.m. <clears throat> now I gotta decide if I wanna get up and uh, change my clothes or if I wanna put on uh, that or that. I need to get some pink shoes, man. I got shoes that match almost everything. I don't know, we're gonna look, oh, I'll kick this right off my foot. Ugh. See, I wore this with, uh, wore this with the spark. It doesn't really match this shirt, but it goes good enough to, uh, like when it's on your feet, and you see it far enough away, these old forces. I mean, they're not old, old. They got, look, all the tread is still there, man. They ain't even wore off a piece yet. But they're older. They're not brand new. Uh, they go all right with that. Uh, well, I can't reach back there to see nothing. I don't know. Either, man. Look, tomorrow, I'm going to come back with a video probably about some of these coats because people have been asking about uh, which ones are warm and which ones ain't. Plus, I'm warming up a little bit. My, my ears is getting hot because I've been drinking this moonshine. I mean, I just crushed a half a, half a jar by my lonely in 27 minutes. So it's probably about that time. Big Waldowski, peace.